Um, it is a Merida Silex 400. It's the year before last because hell oh people and welcome to another video. This one is going to be about this bike and how I cycle indoors during the winter. Let's go. In the winter, nobody wants to go cycling outside anyway. Too cold, whole path can be icy. I've already fallen off my bike four times in one ride uh, a few months ago and damaged my bike. For an indoor bike trainer, but I didn't want one where you keep the wheel on because you have to get a new tire and my wheels are tubeless, which means I've got to take, I either got to get a new wheel and new tire and tube, put it on the back wheel and the cassette as well. Cause as you can see, Come has a cassette on it. So I wanted a wheel off trainer. And all they have to do is get a new cassette that's identical to the one I've already got on that wheel that I use on my bike. And then get the trainer that you put the bike onto. So here it is. It's a um, the TAC X Nero, TAC X Nero T2. There you go, smart. I will like that. It is a, uh, it's, a it's magnetic. Uh, when you pedal on say, uh, Zwift, which is what you usually use. And when you go up hills, it tells you changes the wattage from like 135, 150, 170, 200, 300, whatever wattage the, 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 the track that you do goals for. It readjusts it for you, so you know don't have to ha you don't have to change your gear. So I've kept it in that gear there, and I've put a piece of um, cardboard in my rear disc brake because I'm not paying ten or whatever pounds for a piece of plastic to put in there when all it's there is for in case you pull the back brake by accident, it doesn't clamp together. You put that in so it clamps against the cardboard. But this is my bike. Um, it is a Merida Silex 400. It's the year before last because a brand new one's around 1600 quid here in the UK. This was 1200 pounds because it's, it's, they're getting rid of it for the net for the next one. I had a bike fit because I did fall off as I said they got me on it. I, and there's a story on these pedals of why I've got these and I've changed them from my pedals. Before videoing in my um, my channel about my crash and going through this this bike generally um so that's the uh the, the garmin tax i thought it was tac x but it's tax garmin tax um nero t2 and it comes with different um like washes and stuff and really good um basically so basically i've got that i've got my shoes and on the wear it comes with a a thing to stop your front wheel moving when you're riding so you don't like you don't like get a bit uh like oh when you're riding your stick keeps it there now you can get a 150 pound stand for your computer or you put a or you can put a screen up on the wall but i've got these two boxes it's makeshift um basically two boxes i put my laptop on the box and I put the drift on and it works basically. It's all you need, it's in front of me, I can see it. In the summer or in the spring, I might take this downstairs. When I get the, in the, have a TV downstairs and play it on there, then it'd be sweet or whatever, just use like that. But for now, that'll do for me. Spend 200, 300 quid on a, on a, uh, a fan because it will get warm when you're cycling, not out and about. And that's the point is so I went and got um, just a general old fan I've got. Uh, basically that's it, just a general old fan, it works. I only have it on low, on the, on the lowest setting, because it's just a bit, just for a bit of a breeze, because when you're out cycling, a little bit of a breeze is fine for you, just to keep you cool. Um, I have my water there, and I have a towel. The towel is to protect any joints around there, any metal. Since the crash and I had it re I had, a, I had a six week service on this for it was part of the deal with the um, with the shop that I bought it from. After six weeks or so, you come back and they service it, make sure everything's fine. You tell them any, any, anything that's wrong with it, that you found wrong with it. And so they lowered the seats a bit from me. So seeing it like this, like seeing it like that, 
and leaning too much it has to be nice and comfortable they basically turned that the um they undid these and they turned it up slightly so these come they were down here now they're up here more so it's more comfortable to ride and then i've just plugged it in there as you do and plug the fan over there and that's got plenty of uh, power in it but if you were doing it on, uh, generally i've got that there and i've got a plug extension lead down there so if i ever have to plug the uh the laptop in i can do but i probably won't i just wait until it's charged fully to start fanning around and that's it i go for it and went over the summer if i decided to just to race over the summer it was raining i've got my v-lux here so i've got air coming from there i've got fan coming from there i've got my zwift on there my bike my trainer my kind of makeshift table although i probably will get another table down the line another video on my channel about this bike and also about why I put those pedals on as opposed to my other pedals. These pedals are two-sided. One is for cleat and one is for normal. I'll explain, there's a video, as like I said, to explain why, because before I had one that side and one that side, both the same. So that's my, uh, my Zwift indoor cycling setup really good i enjoy it it's a good setup it does the job for me if you've enjoyed this uh um, smash that thumbs up button helps the algorithm tell you that you liked the video and pushes to other people who might help um, it is a good thing this this uh, this tack um, x garmin it does have some give so rather it does that it has a bit of give so when you're riding it means sturdy and there's no movement when you when you're cycling normally there's movement in your bike, so it, it helps uh, give that natural feel to your ride and more um, more comfortable for you. Smash that like button, subscribe down below. So I'm about to, as you can see, I'm in my shorts. I'm just about to do a half an hour, 40 minute cycle. And let me know what you think down below of my setup. Thanks again, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.